It is an invisible thief that steals memories and independence, Alzheimer's disease. For decades, the fight has been a brutal one, focused only on the brain itself. But what if the cure for aging wasn't in our heads but in our blood? A landmark study from Cedar sinai is turning the tide. Researchers there have found a way to reverse cognitive decline and Alzheimer's symptoms in mice. Not with a brain-altering drug, but with what they call young immune cells. We took adult human cells, essentially hit a reset button to turn them back into youthful stem cells, and then guided them to become these young immune cells. When we introduced them into the older mice, the change was dramatic. Their memory improved, and we saw significant structural improvements in the hippocampus, the brain's memory center. But here is the stunning twist, the therapeutic cells never actually entered the brain. Instead, they acted as a remote control for healing. Researchers believe these new, healthy cells release anti-aging signals into the bloodstream. These signals, tiny particles called extracellular vesicles, then travel to the brain, providing the vital reset it needs. This fundamentally shifts how we think about brain aging. It tells us that we might not need to surgically target the brain. We may just need to rejuvenate the body's communication system. We are essentially using the immune system as the delivery mechanism for a systemic, anti-aging signal. The research remains preclinical, a necessary first step on a long road. But for millions of families battling Alzheimer's and other forms of cognitive decline, this breakthrough offers more than just scientific intrigue. It offers a new kind of hope that the answer to a long, healthy life may already be inside us, waiting to be unlocked.